Katie Hill with Merck Animal Health is joining me now. Thank you so much. I know we were just talking about the buzz around here at NCBA. You've been busy. I'm seeing customers and just advocating for the industry and meeting friendly new maybe customers. Um, but before we get into any of that, let's kind of go into your background, being raised in this industry and your involvement now. Yes, well, I grew up on the central coast of California. Uh, my family has ranched there since the 1870s. My great grandfather came over from the Azores and uh, we're still ranching uh, that same, same area. And um, I grew up um, there, but also part-time in uh, Prescott, Arizona, involved in Brodeo. So kind of the different facets of the industry as I've uh, dabbled in a lot of different areas. How have um, you being involved in the different facets? And I know you mentioned rodeo right now, and that is an extensive career that you had in that, and we'll get into that in a minute. Um, but how has that prepared you for the role you're in today, being kind of in both sides of it? Sure. Well, I think, you know, all of us have such a unique tapestry of experiences. And uh, if I could say that I had a linear path to where I am right now career-wise, uh, I, I didn't really. Uh, I think it was just, that's the beauty of God's plan. And all of my uh, experiences and things that have happened throughout the course of my life have, uh, I hope, uh, made me a, a, a better person and have contributed to, obviously, this, this, this career I have with Merck and have, has helped me pour into our customers and our team. And I just think, I think that's, I don't, I don't think we land anywhere on accident. I think it's all, all God's plan. Um, speaking of Merck Animal Health, you've been with them for a little while. Um, talk about how they really care for their customers and really for the industry and your part and your role that you play in advocating for the industry. Absolutely, yes. Merck, Merck is really focused on the customer. We're a solutions-based company, whether it's our uh, biopharma or our technology but we really have the mindset of focusing on customers. It's an other-centered mindset, and, and that's what our team is really built upon, is finding the best solution for our customer. And, and I feel really blessed to work for a company that values that because this industry is, is a family, and it's, it's really important that, uh, you know, Merck is a, a huge global leader in animal health and, and human health, but it really boils down to people and their livelihood, and that is at the forefront of, of what we do every day. Yeah. Well, speaking of livelihood, again, growing up on a ranching family in California, uh, a lot of ranching families, farming families from there, um, diverse country to ranch and farm on, but you're a silversmith, you're a horseman, you um, were a rodeo queen, you have a journalist, you have so many things that are kind of in your bucket that you've accomplished throughout your years. Um, what is your advice for young women um, of all ages that are wanting to be a little more involved in this industry and have more of a voice in this industry? Well, I would say we need you and there's room for you. And if you don't fit the mold, then break the mold. We need advocates more now more than ever, uh, especially in this, this industry. Absolutely. Well, an impressive resume of Katie Hills right here. Um, and again, we just thank you so much for everything you're doing for our industry. Wise words, advocating, great wisdom shared for young women who might want to get involved or women who are already involved and just, you know, want to take that next step. So thank you so much for sharing with us here on RFD TV and the Cowboy Channel, Katie. Thank you.